uh, for a talk that's called World Autism Awareness Day. So, are you speaking to us, uh, Nora, or is it uh, April? I'm Leonora Gregory Kalura, and I'm the founder of the International Naturally Autistic People Awards Convention Festival, which is now in its fifth year and going off to Edinburgh by invitation of the Lord Provost and the City of Edinburgh. And we have tonight the Canadian representative, uh, she's the official representative for Canada, the Canadian High Commissioner George uh, Gordon Campbell is aware of what we're doing. We met with him in October and we'll be meeting with him again this month. So please welcome April Dawn Griffin from Saskatchewan, third recipient for visual arts representing Canada and official representative for Canada to the awards event. having me to your beautiful city. It's my second trip here and I'm absolutely in love with the place. Um, I'm the ambassador for the Autistic People's Federation and I'll also be representing Canada along with 27 other delegates in Scotland and we have 14 of the delegates here tonight. I really, this is really important to get autism awareness out there so that we can get workplaces uh, aware and able for us to go into the workplace if, if it's possible. And I really want to thank Gibsons for lighting up gold. And I want to introduce Ella and Arnie, who are representing the town of Gibsons in Scotland. I'm drawn to uh be re, 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 uh, representing uh, Gibsons and uh, surrounding area, and also speaking for uh, Mayor Roll over there. My name is Arnie Grant, I'm past president of, of this branch. So I'm, I'm very proud of, of uh, what Charlie and uh, Leonora have been doing for autism. Uh, I don't know if a lot of you people realize that autism is. Uh, one in 68 people have autism, and uh, they're doing very well in uh, uh, promoting the, uh, the Autism Society all over the world. Thank you. I would also like to introduce two of our performers who will be performing in Edinburgh, Scotland for us, Ella and Ka uh, Kira. and Gibsons, the Sunshine Coast, and we are raising money for the International Natural Autistic People's Awards Convention and Festival. We're raising money for us and other delegates to go to Edinburgh, Scotland in October. Our kickoff fundraiser is Wednesday, April 2nd, 6 to 10 p.m. at Boomer's Burger Bar. Um, it's thirty dollars per ticket. It includes burger, Boomer's Burger meal, the soft drink, tickets, draws, prizes. There's live entertainment and there's a silent auction. And me and Carol will be there. Yeah. <laughs> Saturday for our fundraiser at the tables and you can also buy tickets at www.naturallyautistic.com and you can buy it from our tables. Do we know on you to be there? <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you, uh, Ella and Sierra. And uh, I did have the opportunity last year uh, when the event was hosted here on the Sunshine Coast uh, to attend uh, most of the events. Uh, it was a very successful uh, one. So I did have a proclamation that I'll uh, read. Uh, whereas the number of people on the autism spectrum averaged one in every 110 births, and whereas people on the autism spectrum come from every country throughout the world, regardless of race, religion, or culture, and whereas we diligently work to address discrimination and reshape attitudes towards our most vulnerable citizens and family members, and whereas our understanding of people on the autism spectrum is growing such that today many children and adults on the autism spectrum are able to lead happy and productive lives, and whereas we recognize the importance of providing avenues for people on the autism spectrum to demonstrate their abilities, talents, and gifts so that they can be accepted as full, fully participating members of our communities. Now, therefore, I, Wayne Rowe, Mayor of the Town of Gibson, to hereby proclaim April 2nd, 2014, as World Autism Awareness Day, and the official kickoff for the International Naturally Autistic People Awards Convention and Festival on the Sunshine Coast, British Columbia, and the Town of Gibson's. And I'll be with you tomorrow night for that. Okay.